Hi guys, I'm Shmi. Good morning to you. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to a lovely sunny morning here in Dubai where we're about to join Supercar Owners Circle for a run from the Armani Hotel at the never-ending Burj Khalifa Tower to go from here over to SBH Royal Auto Gallery to check out some of the cars there. And as you can see from the skittles around me, it is a very supercar themed morning. So let's get started with a little look at all of the cars here and then it will be convoy time over on the roads towards Abu Dhabi. What do we have here then? Let's take a walk down the line of cars. Starting off at the end, a twin pair of Aventador S's, one gloss, one matte. Then we have a pair of Hurricane Performantes, one matte orange, one gloss green. And those come from Lamborghini Dubai, who are sponsoring the event. Then we get to the Carabas McLaren P1. So I saw this car the other day, the carbon red. Just look at this up close. It is stunning. So we'll take a better look at that and the more sunshine later on. What a car, awesome to see it again. Then we have a GT3 RS. We have Supercars Majlis's uh, Lamborghini Huracan as well. Then we have a Carrera GT parked here top down. Best way for a Carrera GT, that V10. The wing is up as well, which is kind of cool. Then we have another Huracan here as well. A lovely, lovely dark red GT3 RS. That's a really nice color. Like that an awful lot. A Ventor SV from Supercars Club Arabia, we've seen that car before. We have an F12, we have a Vanquish, that's quite unusual, earlier generation Vanquish, an LP580 Red Hurricane, another Hurricane 720S here, just being stickered up, ready for the event uh, in grey, and oh, look what we've got there. A 918 Spider's turned up at the end, I didn't even see that coming in. Always fun, roof down, has that little wind deflector you can see on the top that makes it slightly less uh, blustery in the cabin. So there might be some more cars to attend, so far the lineup's looking pretty cool. Look at those wings over there. Just look at the view over the back. We will get set though, shortly, when all of the cars are in, for a briefing, I think, and then it'll be time to get on the move. It's just about time to start now, and the cars are lining up, starting to head out. We've got a police convoy, as you can see, at the front to lead this adventure, this journey today. Cars moving into the sunshine here, out of the shadow of this incredible building. It is crazy to be here. There is a hotel at the bottom, which is where we're actually starting off from. Let's be performante. The crackles of the various cars in the line up here. You can feel the atmosphere, everybody's getting ready. <laughs> oh, perfect. This is going to be a very fun day. <laughs> the V12 Angry Bulls. So I am going to come through this way because for today's adventure, Porsche Heaven, 918 Carrera GT. I am going to jump into the Hurricane from Supercars Majlis. So this Hurricane has a Revo Sport body kit. Uh, you've got a carbon fiber fixed wing at the rear. It has an IP exhaust. It sounds absolutely nuts. More to come with this car, I think, in due course. I'm going to be jumping in it for the drive today. Tire writing as well for this journey to cruise and enjoy the carnage and craziness. So oh, here we go, let us step in. Craziness commences now, right? So, whoop. nice little lineup right in front of us, out into the sunshine. Good start. This kind of traffic jam is just fine by me. Oh, the whale of the V10. Now that is quite a lineup in front of us. Supercar Skittles at their very finest. <laughs> there are worse days than sitting behind a P1 and a 918. Abu Dhabi. 
speed, the tarmac changed as well. But this convoy is ridiculous. Two yellow fence doors up there. Crazy, crazy. see a Vector driving today. It's actually really cool how low the Vector is, complete wedge shape. I've just never filmed one before, which is quite rare. We have another Aventador SV. Uh, there are worse ways to arrive than in a convoy like this. Oh, what a crazy lineup. Mirror view. Ridiculous. Oh, there is a lineup of cars here under cover. I wonder what we have up there. We shall find out shortly. Well, the 918 is parking up in that very colourful little lineup, I am coming to check out this the Vector W8 Twin Turbo. This thing is just crazy. I like that it's got a UK jersey plate on there still. Wow. While the final cars line up to park, I'm going to come and show you this P1 again. I promised earlier that we'd have a look at the carbon in the sunshine. Well, now we've got a little bit more sunshine. Let's just check this out. It's gleaming. It's the same shade of red, I believe, as the satin red that this car was painted before it got the new bare carbon fiber panels. It was done, redone at MSO to give it a new look. It's got the normal black carbon through the rear, red carbon on the main kind of body panels and the red calipers to go with that. Super cool. It goes without saying that every stop in here is a good stop. There are just so many incredible cars, but obviously we are here today to take a proper look at the Lamborghini Centenario in carbon with the red accent. So we'll see that when we come back. We're actually heading over to the annex, so the separate part of the Royal Auto Gallery. So we'll have a look in there. Here we are then, and I've actually visited in here before, but let's have a little look around because I didn't feature it in my full tour of SBH Royal Auto Gallery, and there are a couple of the modern Ferraris, so the F12 TDF, the 430 Scuderia, the 458 Speciale Aperta, 599 presumably HGTE maybe, then 675 LT Spider, uh, Testa Rossa, and what, ooh, another F40 over here. 4GT. Around the outside you have a lot of the, the legendary cars of the GCC, so different Range Rovers, Defenders, I think there's every generation of Defender lined up back there. And if we come through there's some unusual stuff towards the far corner. Um, some American cars in this little section, more trucks and buggies and things, a few Pullmans even. The uh, Mercedes Pullmans here. Um, but this, I want to come and show you this, this was a Mustang? I'm not entirely sure what exactly it is, apart from a complete custom... It's like a, an off-roading Mustang built with a traditional style, and it's a convertible. And then there's F1 car, a camel. I think that was a special race-winning camel back in the days before it um, died, of course. And then, yeah, <laughs> more crazy stuff. This is a very eclectic collection and part of the museum. I suppose I ought to take a little moment to walk around the Centenario. The full carbon with the red accents, one of just 20 coupes in the world. Not that many of them will have the full carbon body that you can see on this car. Um, LP770-4, 6.5 litre V12 in the back, 770 horsepower, all-wheel drive naturally. It's loosely based on an Aventador, but obviously slightly changed, modified, and very visually different to that to make it into the Centenario. I always think at the back here, sitting with the wing up, but the diffuser is just mental. It's very open, you can see the radiators behind the wheels, and then the triple exhaust down at the bottom at the center. Crazy thing. From 
cars to coming behind to the area where we're going to do some drifting with Sheikh Khalifa KSN 11. <laughs> and he knows how to do it. This is awesome. Okay. <laughs> right, belt up. That was pretty fun, jumping into the car there. A bit spontaneous and random, but awesome to experience a little bit of sideways back here. But now it is time to head back over. The Anniversario Bull is rolling out. Oh, I'm in the way, sorry, sorry. <laughs> Get out of the way of that. And we'll, uh, I think, probably head to the, towards the front and that might be the end of today for now. 812 super fast, very nice. SL65 Black Series, white with chrome window. Super, super cool. And then a gone in 60 seconds, Eleanor. That is quite a variety of cars right there. An original Aventador, LP700 style. Well, that brings an end to today's proceedings with the Aventador revving away in the background there. It has been awesome fun. Most of the cars have already departed, headed over to Yas Marina. It's the Formula One Grand Prix weekend, so naturally there's a lot to see over there. We're gonna head over as well. That won't be on camera naturally, but it has been amazing today with Supercar Owners Circle. Big thanks to them for hosting us. I guess to be part of this adventure and also, of course, for the Hurricane owner that I've been with, Supercars Majlis. Big thanks as well. I hope you guys have enjoyed the visit, seeing a little bit inside SBH, the Centenario, then the spontaneity of jumping into the drift car. Things happen out here in Dubai and Abu Dhabi that you never necessarily expect, but it's always good times. Anyway, thank you very much as always for watching guys. That's it for now. I'll catch up with you again very soon. Cheers.